Hey guys, Adam here from Guru Gamers. And there's Zoe, right there. She just like dropped out of the sky. She's like a superhuman. And now she's jumping. Great. And off she goes. Bye. Today I'm going to be teaching you how to make a very small, compact, uh, simple to make redstone pulsar. And all you're going to need is this redstone right at the bottom. Uh, you're going to need less redstone dust than that. I just gave myself that much for the fun of it, even though I'm in creative mode as well. So you're going to start off with the comparator, and it's going to go there. It doesn't matter where you put it, but everything else matters after that. You're going to put a repeater right there, and one right there. Make sure that it's facing the correct direction, and then place your redstone dust as follows. One in the corner, and two on the edge right there. Now you're going to need an input for the comparator, which goes right here. You can have it going wherever you want, and then you can start it with a lever, and that will be great. Before you press the lever, you need to make sure that this is in subtraction mode. You do that by right-clicking, and it should look like that. Uh, I'm also going to put these into the second mode, uh, just because it'll go a bit slower, and you'll be able to see the effect more. So, start it, and there we go. Isn't that amazing? And you can stop it too. It's a toggleable pulsar. And there's a chicken. Just to show you that it works, I'm going to take our dirt, and no we're not because there's a chicken in the way. I'm going to take our dirt, and we're going to put a torch there. Yay, it works. And you can turn it off. Great. That's it for this tutorial. Don't forget to comment if you have any questions, and you can subscribe because I'll be doing some more redstone tutorials very shortly.